Hey everyone, this is Sofia Ansari. Thanks for stopping by. In today's video, I would be sharing with you guys reviews and swatches of Sugar Smudge Me Not Liquid Lipstick. But before starting with the swatches and the review, please make sure you subscribe to my channel. Also, click on the bell notification button so that you are notified each time I upload a new video. So, let's get started and we would start with the packaging part. If you talk about packaging, it is this. This is their basic packaging for all their sugar products. So this is the cardboard packaging in which it comes. They have their shade mentioned on two sides. And guys, this is the actual product. It comes in a transparent packaging like this with matte black lid, you can say. And they have their logo over here. And they have sugar mentioned over here. Plus they have the name sugar smudge me not liquid lipstick mentioned here and on the bottom part they have their shade mentioned like oh this is the shade 04 plum yum as it comes in a clear packaging it is quite easy for you to recognize which lipstick is of which shade coming on to the pricing part these retails for rupees 499 for 4.5 ml of product which lasts for a really long time i've already shared with you the packaging part and the pricing part along with the quantity moving on to the next is the formula of this lipstick the formula of this lipstick is mossy it is not watery at all so what happens is when you apply it it dries out in one to two seconds these are super drying so if you are a kind of person who doesn't like super drying lipstick you won't like this one if you want you can first apply a lip balm and then apply this lipstick to keep it a bit moisturized now moving on to the wand part the wand of this lipstick is like this so and it is really short so it helps you to draw a precise line and you do not need a lip liner to line your lips and then apply this lipstick also <clears throat> the staying power of this lipstick is five to six hours and if you eat anything in between or if you drink anything it would come off from the center of your lip that is the thing with normally all the liquid lipsticks so i don't mind that um, now taking off this lipstick it is quite pain to take off the lipstick so what you can do is either you can rub vaseline on it and let it sit for some time and then take it off or you can also use coconut oil or any other oil or you can use any makeup remover because if you directly try to remove it out with a tissue or something it won't come off so this was about that and another thing like if you are thinking of retouching the lipstick i would suggest you to take the entire lipstick off and then i'll reapply it if you apply a second layer it tends to get a bit patchy and one more thing when you remove this lipstick it doesn't stain your lips that is a great thing which i really like otherwise what happens is when you take off liquid lipstick it tends to set in your lines this doesn't happen with this one also i have noticed that few sugar caps they do not have sugar mentioned like this in this one it has sugar mentioned over here and in this it doesn't have so i don't know what is the difference maybe the formula is different or something like that i'm really not aware they have come up with new shades so you get to choose from around 20 shades so it is like a vast range from which you can choose these are just five which i really liked and i purchased it for myself this is not a sponsored video this was everything that I want to share with you all about the Sugar Smudge Me Not Liquid Lipstick. The first one that I've swatched is the shade 03 Tan Fan. And this is how it looks on me. The second shade that I want to share with you guys is 04 Plum Yum. And this is how it looks on me. This has a little bit of pink undertone and the earlier one had like a brown undertone to it. So these two look really very similar but they are different. The third one that I've swatched is 05 Rust Lust. And this is how it looks on me.
I really like this one. The fourth one that I've swatched is uh, in the shade 10 Drop Dead Red. And this is how it looks. This is like a perfect red color and this would suit almost every one the wheater skin as well as the fairer skin one it would suit each and every one if you are not comfortable wearing red lipstick try out this one you would love this one the last one that i've swatched is 01 and this is the shade brazen raisin and this is how it looks This one is my all time favorite and this is the one that I can wear every day. Hope this was useful for you guys and if this was useful please make sure you subscribe to my channel and also click on the bell notification button so that you are updated with my latest videos. I would see you guys next time till then take care bye bye.